Today, I want to find out why pumpkins give us so much energy. Pumpkins are very nutritious. They're very energy rich. But why is that? Well, I'm going to put a pumpkin today under the microscope. Yes, under the microscope to find out. Hello and welcome. Microbe Hunter here. And it's October. Um, October is pumpkin time. So this is the time to make pumpkin pie and also pumpkin soup. And of course, I've also been eating a lot of pumpkins recently. But I would like to find out now is why are pumpkins so energy rich? And for this reason, I'm preparing right now um, a little bit of pumpkin uh, for my micro, uh, for my microscope. I've uh, cut open a pumpkin. I scratched off a little bit of the surface of the pumpkin and whatever is now yeah on the slide I would like uh, to observe in a high magnification. Well I found out that I did not have enough of the sample material so I repeated this a little bit. You can see the pulp of the pumpkin um, on my knife tip um, but something has been washed off um, into the drop of water here. A cover glass goes on top and now under the microscope I'm able to find out why the pumpkins are so energy rich. Yes and uh, this is now my microscope. Everything goes on the stage age of the microscope and then I had to really go up with the magnification quite a bit. I also had to turn up the light and look, this is what I found. Look at this, thousands and thousands of those tiny little dots. And that is the answer to the question. Those dots are our main energy source of pretty much all human beings in all cultures. Those little dots that you see over there are the main energy source. And what are they? Well, this is starch. Um, right now you're looking at the starch grains um, of a pumpkin and it doesn't matter in which culture, in which uh, region of the world you look, in most uh, places starch is our main energy source. Whether you eat rice, potatoes, wheat, corn or pumpkins, <laughs> it doesn't really matter. Uh, the starch is digested by our body and it provides us uh, with glucose. And here we can see the pumpkin cells. I made very thin cuts and I stained the pumpkin cells with iodine. And the iodine combines with the starch, the starch grains, and gives a black color. And these are now the starch grains inside the cell. And that's the answer. And what I would like to do now is I'd like to invite you to the Reddit page that I have. And at the Reddit page, um, you can also post your own pictures of those pumpkin starch grains beneath the video. So that's it for today. I do hope uh, that you liked uh, the video again and uh, I wish you all the best. Happy microbe hunting as always and uh, see you around next time. Bye-bye.